In this video, we're going to look at completing the Activity 3 template. In this template, we've got to provide evidence of our queries and our report. So query A, we've got to provide a design view and data sheet view. When you're doing these images, make sure that the examiner can see everything in your query design. So for example, the query name, the tables, all the fields, and also the columns are wide enough so none of the detail is truncated. Let's have a look at query B. Now let's have a look at evidence in the report. And you need to make sure in the report, if you've got any controls, which you've got calculations in, and they're truncated, so for example, where these counts are, you need to make sure you widen the control so that the examiner can see exactly how the counts are calculated. You also need to make sure you provide evidence of any queries that you've used in your report and also a data sheet view. You also need to provide evidence that you've saved your report as a PDF just taking a clip here from the file explorer showing it saved as a PDF. I'm also going to paste in an image of it opened in a web browser as well. But you will also include that PDF file in your folder that's going to be sent to the examiner. So we've completed Activity 3 template, that's Activity 3 now complete. The next video will be covering Activity 4, which is the testing.